iced chai tea latte. So good. Let's talk nighttime routine. Sometimes we do it, sometimes we don't, and sometimes we just forget. But it's definitely worth it to spend some time at night to care for your skin, and more importantly, care for yourself. And for me personally, I love my nighttime routine because it helps relax me, and especially if you guys have had a long day at school or at work or at home, it's the perfect way to end your day. So in today's video, I'm gonna be sharing with you guys my 10 beauty tips for your nighttime routine. So if you guys wanna see what I get up to before I go to bed and get my beauty sleep, Let's get started. First up, skincare. I'm gonna put on my spa headband and then tie my hair back. Now it's time to remove makeup. The easiest way to remove makeup I find is to use makeup wipes. And I've gone through probably five packs of these Yesy wipes. They are amazing. They're hypoallergenic and paraben free, which is great. I'm gonna gently start removing all the makeup on my face. And when it comes to eye makeup, I bring in the big guns. I always like using my Shiseido eye makeup remover to really get in there. And this remover is really good and can easily take off waterproof makeup as well. I just gently swipe a Q-tip over the eyes and remove any leftover eye makeup. Now let's do a deep clean. I'm gonna rinse my face with some warm water and then I'm gonna bring out my Vichy cleansing gel and my go-to Shiseido facial brush. Get a good foam going and start cleansing in circular motions all over the face. I find this to be the most important part of skincare and it's making sure that you get all that makeup off your face so that your skin can breathe and rejuvenate when you're sleeping. After about a minute of using the brush, I'm gonna rinse it off with some warm water and pat dry. Now it's time for serum. I've been loving the organic Moroccan argan oil by Sensuals. I've always been a big fan of its healing properties and the fact that it's great for dry skin. I'm gonna add a few drops of this to my fingers and press this goodness all over my face and neck. And to help moisturize the skin, I'm gonna apply my go-to perfecting cream by Andalo Naturals all over the face. I find that serum always absorbs better when you put moisturizer on afterwards. And to finish my nighttime skincare routine, I can't forget about the eyes. I'm using my Desert Essence Gentle Nourishing Cream. I like to apply a generous amount to keep those fine lines and wrinkles away. A really important beauty tip I do every night is to apply cuticle oil to my nails because my nails tend to get really dry so when I apply it just before bed, it's got all night to soak in and in the morning, they feel great. When it comes to sleeping, I find that propping up my pillows really helps with draining any congestion in the face. This definitely helps if you tend to get puffy in the morning too. I think we've heard this one before. Go to bed at the same time every night and that will benefit your nighttime routine even more. So set your alarm and stick with it. Now how many of you guys sleep with an eye mask? I definitely need one and the softer it is, the better. And last but not least, I gotta have some lavender to help me relax. And I love putting a few drops of lavender oil into a humidifier and letting that go throughout the night. And now, I'm ready for bed. All right guys, I hope you enjoyed this video and got some tips here for your nighttime routine. And remember, these are just my personal tips. You can use all of them, you can use some of them. Just make sure that your routine is easy and simple enough that you look forward to doing it every night. And of course, if you guys haven't done this already, be sure to click on that subscribe button, give this video a thumbs up if you liked it, and comment below and let me know if you guys liked this video and if you have any awesome nighttime routine tips you wanna share with me or with the community. Also, you guys, I won't be here on Friday because I'm going on a very special mini vacay this weekend. If you guys want to see where I'm heading to and why I'm going there, head on over to my Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. I'll definitely be posting where I'll be. But I will be back next Wednesday, and I can't wait to see you guys when I get back. Have a great week, and I'll see you very soon on the next episode of Tips. Bye!